A massive NATO drill continues in the Baltic Sea. More than 5,000 air, sea and ground troops are taking part in Operation Baltops 2015 on a beach landing on the Polish coast. According to NATO, the multinational maritime exercise demonstrates the resolve of allied and partner forces to defend the Baltic region as Russia continues to threaten the security of the Baltic and Eastern European region. Latvian Foreign Minister Edgar Rinkovich said the NATO exercises were vital in the face of continuing Russian aggression. Latvia and its neighbours, Estonia and Lithuania, were all part of the Soviet Union until 1991 and are now members of the European Union. They are wary about Russia and have watched with alarm as ties have frayed over the Ukraine crisis. It shows that uh, we have to be really prepared uh, to respond as the NATO uh, to such kind of threats through adding probably more troops, more uh, military equipment uh, in the Baltic states in Poland. Referring to the Russian-backed invasion of Ukraine, Rungovich said the violations of the Minsk peace deal had forced the extensions of sanctions, and he warned that escalating tensions there risked spiraling out of control. We cannot say that the Minsk agreement is totally broken, but what we have seen recently is that the level of tension is increasing. So. Um, so far, I would say that uh, uh, we are in a situation where uh, Minsk agreement can be broken any time. And uh, in that case, of course, uh, we are going to see a totally different situation, which is not going to be better. So I would still refrain of uh, saying that uh, Minsk doesn't work. Russia, meanwhile, held air defense drills in the southern Rostov and Krasnodar regions close to the border with Ukraine. Since Russia's annexation of Ukraine's Crimea region in March 2014, Russia has held numerous large-scale military drills, checking combat readiness. Ukraine and the West say the drills allow Russia to maintain the ability to continuously support militants in East Ukraine and send in large contingents of regular Russian soldiers as and when required.